flashback. And a flashback. Uh, so we just come from Afro Nation, yeah? We haven't slept, you know? We haven't slept. We're going from one event to the other. So we're going flipping. What are we doing today? Central Regions Hall. I think it's like a bloody four hour journey there. And we're slumped. Everyone here, eyes in the car is puffy as hell. But it should be good, man. <laughs> We're all tired, bro. Speak for yourself. We're all tired, bro. We're all tired, man. But yeah, man, should be good, man. Should be good. All right, so right now, we're at the Kakum National Park. Uh, something I've actually really wanted to do because past couple of days I've just done party, 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 party. No sleep, party, party, party. I actually wanted to see some lovely nature this time. Um, so it should be good. We're kind of here in a mixed group of Brits and Americans. Um, so yeah, man, stay tuned. All right, right now we're on um, Kakon Bridge. Um, do you know? I even mentioned it earlier. It reminds me of Goal Eight. Like, let me even flip the camera. So as you can see, we kind of got the single, uh, the single slab of wood. On either side, you've got the nets as well, which you can kind of basically use for balance. Um, but this bridge goes on for quite a while still. Yes, I do. <laughs> See, we're getting a bit higher up now. It's bloody beautiful, man. Mad hot, though, but bloody beautiful. Right, so that's the Kakum Bridge wrapped up. I swear, when I'm doing this nature exploring stuff, I'm in my bag, you know. I mean, I can get lit, yeah, that's for certain, but when it comes to exploring, and doing up door, exploring that them things there. Listen, now, I'm in my bag when it comes to this thing. So we got two more sites left as part of the tour. Um, as as I, like I mentioned previously, uh, I didn't look at anything that was going to be a part of this tour because I just wanted to experience it first time. So bridge done and dusted, ticked off the list. Um, two more sites to go. I think we're going to a castle. I think I don't know. You'll see. But um, yeah, man. Nonetheless, looking forward to it. Just need to get back in the coach and. Have some AC fam, because it's boiling bro, it's boiling. They're feeding us good out here with the tour. They've got the highlights playing in the background. This is my first proper move for two days in. As I said, I'm gonna finish me fam. As I said before, be careful what you eat and drink in Ghana fam. What? But I saw finish Ghana fam, I claim it. Again. Whilst they were here, they were still chained to each other. They ate twice, morning and evening. They ate in their palm. That means food just to keep you going, not for you to die. This place was for the young girls, as young as 12 years, to like 25 years. They poo poo here, really. Maces, everything was done here, and they sleep in it. Many of them died. Most of the ladies got pregnant. After you give birth, the child is taken from the mother, and the mother is brought back to the dungeon. The door of no return, as you see here, was not as big as we see. It was that small door, very narrow, that you have to bend down before you can pass through. Now we are also passing through the same door of no return, but you are sure of returning. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So we just hit up the new Ocom. Um, I didn't even give you guys the full tour of the first Ocom because I mean everyone was already settled into the rooms and whatnot. But I can actually give you a proper tour this time round. Alright, cool. Let's begin the tour. This is my humble abode. So I've got the don't know double bed set up, queen bed set up. Um, but I mean the highlight of this room is the bathroom, man. Like th this is this is this is this is what I yearned for. Like 
amazing. Man could what? Man's got the bathtub, the shower. I can dabble between the two. Before we get to the rest of the crib, actually, show you the outside settings. Um, I mean, you can't really see it probably, but you've got a swimming pool right there. Lovely mirror, which we didn't have in our previous accommodation. Corner sofa. This is the kitchen. Another little bathroom. Bedroom in here, but I won't venture in too far because it's already been claimed. This bedroom as well, um, and bathroom around the corner. So now this is a bloody dirty joint, man. Bloody beautiful. Well, it's New Year's Eve now, so we need to try and pattern a little something for tonight. Everything's just to be confirmed, to be confirmed, to be confirmed. Like, we've gone, you actually never know the direction of your night. Like, you can plan to go to one place. Oh, God, the ordeal we faced yesterday. I'll save that for another time. Our Ghana, you can plan to go to one place and end up at another place and not even get in. Moral of the story. Hit the strip, get lit, celebrate, then after we can move into 2020 on a fantastic note. <laughs> Listen, this is our actual first night out in Ghana, yeah? Fam, we've taken so many L's, oh my god. We're here till 2, it's lit. It's not even till 2, it's probably till 6 a.m. But we're still gonna enjoy it, we're still gonna live life, and we're still gonna turn up, you get me? Boom, so ra. So last night was so lit, man. Um, we went to the Till 2 um, rooftop party, thingamajig, and we partied basically till like 7 a.m. Like, it was flipping lit, bro. Vibes all the way from the start to the end without fail. But now we're just doing up tourist stuff for today, man, to keep it nice and chill. Or for this morning, anyways. Um, so right now we're here at um, Independence Square. Um, we're gonna capture some footage. There's a bit here on the right, I don't know what it's called, but. Then I was going to ask our resident guy um, to film me in on the details and whatnot. Um, I'm, I'm good, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, so yeah, man, going to cop some stuff, um, take some lovely pictures, um, and catch us some good video for you guys, man. So yeah, bro, let's keep it moving. Okay. Yo, so right now this is Black Star Square. Um, I've just been informed that it's kind of like used for, or for New Year's Eve slash day, it was used for um, just like a massive church service. So you can literally just see the whole area. Um, yeah, this would have been filled up with people. So they're literally like clearing away the chairs, the stage and whatnot now. And when it comes to like the president's um, inauguration as well, um, he'll come here and deliver a speech. Um, I'm assuming in front of like, this space can probably take thousands of people. I don't know how much, but thousands of people. I don't feel like our names, yeah, they're real hustlers. Man's on the goal, with ice cream in the back, fully functioning. Another body there selling sunglasses, and like, that you can't walk uh, 100 meters without catching someone selling something. So it's dope, man, real hustlers. So I think I'm looking in the problem. Start handing out here. Okay. Close bit now. 
Pure enjoyment, fam. We haven't done anything apart from party. That's what there's been. But there's been. There's just been a big skip between now and then, fam. So right now, where did we go? We went Bloom last night. Bloom was a movie, blood. Bloom was a movie. So right now, we're about to go to Ada Apple Park. Um, should be good, man. There's a decent group of us, so um, yeah, man. Really looking forward to it. Alright, so right about now. We're at um, the Apple Safari Park in Ada. Um, it's so beautiful, man. Check out the thing. Get me. So, we're going to be doing up some um, water sports out here. So, I think I'm going to go for some jet skiing, um, go on the speedboats, maybe a bit of canoeing as well. It's whatever tickles my fancy, really. So, it's due to be lit, man. I've got good food here, fantastic music, everything here. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to it, man. Good. So right now we're checking out the skin of a python. So the python actually came to um to kill one of the goats. Then <laughs> the, the the owner said, "Nah, nah, G ain't on that smoke." So they shot it dead and they removed the skin. Um, so this was like five months ago. And I mean, <laughs> from the time we got a swamp there, and where's the goat? The goat's somewhere around, somewhere here. It is bound to happen. So this is live in the flesh. Like, no pun intended, bruv. Feck. So right now you can see the, the crocodiles. Wow. These are like, legit looks like I'm looking at a dinosaur. And there's the other crocodile there on the other side. Um, and this one's just right here. Fam, this is in, crazy, man. bro. Fam, you can't even see it. Wait, wow. Is it? Just hold it. Yeah. You can't do anything. <laughs> Take a video. Take a video. Yeah. What? This is insane. <laughs> oh my God! Wait, this one. I am in flipping shock, fam. Man can't move. <laughs> you believe they don't like those? <laughs> so we're out here. 
Adal Kro. I'm holding a baby. Crocodile or alligator? Crocodile. Crocodile. This is a mad thing. It's well and truly a mad thing, bruv. It's quite very gentle, though. It's gotta be gentle, even, yeah. fam. But, as Monica said, well, Monica said that these could be made into handbags. You know, fucked up, you know that, don't you? Apparently, my man and guy. And chicken as well? Yeah, chicken. The python right here. Just goods inside. And is this big enough to eat a goat? Can I try a little bit? So it depends on the size of the goat. Yes, so we've wrapped up at the Adar Aqua Safari. Oh wow, look at that. Look at that. What a beauty. Did you have a look at this? Wow. Yo, so just flipping, finished eating at um, this joint. I'll flip the camera. Lord of the Wings, if you're in GH. Therefore, here of this spot, fam. The sweet chili wings man had, and then D, what did you get? What the barbecue hot and spicy, oh, spicy too. fam? Yeah. Wavy, bro. Wavy. Check out the interior. I believe they do shisha and them things there as well. I mean, you can't beat it, man. Lord of the wings, 30 food, fam. 30 months. Check it out, right? So, right now, final day in Ghana, but obviously, gotta make the most of it. Right here at the Botanical Gardens, so I'll flip the camera right now. And it's a dope little place, man. I've got a few activities and whatnot here. And obviously, the one I'm going to be doing right now is the high rope course. So basically, kind of similar to a go ape kind of vibe. Um, I mean, the setting is beautiful. Whoa, this bridge is not sturdy, fam. Whoa, fam, this bridge is moving like the bridge at Cocoon, fam. Yeah, we here. Let's take part in it. Ah, oh, this is looking like a mad thing already thick in this heat as well oh but yeah gonna jump on this um it's looking little already so i see someone struggling but um yeah man let's get involved yeah. i ain't done this one so you tell me <laughs> Mad thing. This one's mad. Split in the middle. Oh. Look at the confusion. <laughs> He's a crawling. Hey, my body movements is mad right about now. Good. Ah. Jesus Christ. See, you wanted me to go and do this one. I'm staying right here. If you do one foot, you won't be able to get the one other foot on there. But how can I do such Put above that knot. Oh yeah, you got it, you got it. Kama Lama. Yeah. Imagine Raz become a personal instructor. I don't know who employed him. He's on holiday. He's doing up to tutorial. All right, cool. So as you saw, um, just wrapped up the what you call, basically the equivalent of Go Ape, but in Ghana here at the Lagon Botanical Gardens. Nice, proper beautiful here, man. Proper, proper beautiful. So. If you're gonna be in Ghana, definitely, definitely check out um, the botanical gardens. And right now, I'm overlooking the lake, so I'll flip the camera. So just stunning scenes, man. Stunning, stunning scenes. So I'm here with Josh. Josh, give the people them a wave. You get me? Ra 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 ra. And we made a new friend, Gabriel. What's popping, man? What's popping? Fam, I had a madness trying to get to the airport, bro. Hella problems all over the gaff. Bruv, you can even just see the layer of sweat on my face, but I was local about to board the flight. Ghana fam, it's been lit. Dead to December, for real, for real. So, um, yeah, about to jump on the plane now. Um, yeah, I kind of can't wait to get back, man, because I want my stomach to fix up. Um, so, yeah, peace and love. We out, people. Rah. I'm not going to